Hi, this is Liz. I'm a certified repair technician. Today we're going to be discussing what to do when one of your AirPods won't play sound. Now, I tried every software solution under the sun to fix my poor little AirPods. I tried resetting, changing settings, all sorts of things. Nothing worked because the problem wasn't with the software, it was with the hardware. My right one, something on the inside was wrong. So I'm going to show you a hardware solution uh, so that if none of that stuff worked for you, you'll know what to do like I did. So I even tried putting my AirPods in the cradle, holding down the button in the back, and I noticed that when I was resetting it, that my AirPods would charge. They just, no noise would come out of the right one. And as you'll see in a second, they both light up blue. Now, if you have AirPod ones, yours won't light up when you try to reset them. Don't worry about that. This video works for AirPod one and two. But as you see in a second, they both light up blue. It's just one of them wasn't playing sound because the problem was on the inside. So first thing I did, Oh, also as a side note, if one doesn't light up, then go to our video down below, you're on the wrong video. Now, to get these open, I had to twist it counterclockwise like you see. Initially, I couldn't even get it open, I had to pry it open. But when I pried it open, I noticed that one of the wires had fallen off the speaker, so the speaker was the problem. Um, if you open it up and both are attached, try our video in the link down below. Um, I, this solution won't work for you. So I went ahead and I bought a soldering iron to re-solder on my iron, my uh, wire that had fallen off. Now, now I had to just set the wire on the little piece of solder that had fallen off of. If you need to compare, you can always open up your other AirPod. Uh, now, and then I went ahead and I just used the soldering iron to melt the solder, push down the wire, and then move the glob back on top. Having this little blob of solder that will draw, that will um, cool into a, into a nice little blob that holds the wire down. This took a couple tries. Also, don't touch the wire. The wire heats up. Uh, just use the AirPod and, and the soldering iron to move, maneuver it around. I found that was better. Um, touching it caused problems for me because it heats up. So once it was on there, I went ahead and gave it a tug to make sure it was on there securely. Not too much. Um, it was hard to get it to close. Uh, there's a little notch that you have to get into a groove and into the groove and twist and then kind of push it until it clips shut. It was hard. It took me a good 10 minutes to get it, but eventually I did get it. As you can see, turn and push. Now, after charging, they both work. Thanks for watching our video. If you found it in any way helpful, please like and share. If you like do-it-yourself computer repair videos or you're an egghead like us, then go ahead and subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below and one of our certified repair technicians will get back to you. But anyway, from one egghead to another egghead, this is Liz signing out.